Universal Studios Hollywood, the entertainment capital of LA. Look how many cars still come here, even the sun is going down already. The beautiful Universal Studio globe. It's not moving though, I thought it was spinning. Here I am again on the red carpet, I can't believe it. Just for the GIV, right here at the Universal Studios Hollywood. Welcome to the Universal Studios in Hollywood. And welcome to Grinchmas. That's where we're going tonight, Grinchmas. Yeah, it should be very fun. The, the, the tree lighting should start soon, so we're looking forward to that very much. Well, let's go inside. Let's do it. The yeah. GIV is at the Universal Studios. Camera, lights, action. Darren, I got to walk over here. I've seen like a famous YouTuber touching Alfred Hitchcock's nose all the time when he walks in. I Absolutely. think, I think, right think we got to do that. There he is, Alfred. I think we got to touch the nose, right? Yeah. For all good right, luck. All right, all right. I believe this is the main street. They put the Christmas lights up. But how come they don't put red up there like they do it on Rodeo Drive? The palm tree is red. Look at that checkered taxi with the snow on it. This is California. There's no snow, but they had that much snow today in Germany. Can you believe it? So that's what we're here for today. Merry Grinchmas. They got all this merchandise here. But look, Darren, over there, they got the Jurassic Park. Sure you got the jacket on right there already. Absolutely. Let me see the back. You got it already. Yeah. What? They got a signed hoverboard. Look at this. Christopher Lloyd. There's another one. They all got like signed stuff here from all the different movies. Frankenstein. You could say the German in Venice is the Grinch. All the Jurassic Park stuff. That is one big Santa hand. They got Jaws merchandise. Where's the Back to the Future merchandise? There's some Back to the Future merchandise. Best movie in the world. You know what? I think I'm going to be like a Universal Studios vlogger now. I have to come here more often. I like this place. Nano edition, all three cars. Part one, part two, part three. And if you think about Universal Studios, ET can't be missing. Dracula still moving around here, even though Halloween is over. Oh, just because Halloween is over does not mean I do not like the holidays. Are you from Transylvania? Yes, I oh, yeah. am. The food is much more abundant here though. How the Grinch stole Christmas. You get actually really a little bit of Christmas spirit right now being here. Mystery machine. Oh, boring. I just saw it at the Comic Con. People really like dressing up for Grinchmas. Grinch backpacks. There's Max, the Grinch's dog right here. He's saying hi. Thank you. Merry Christmas. Merry Grinchmas. 2023. Even the snowman looks like the Grinch here. Well, I'm actually nice and warm with my new down jacket. I love it. They're gonna have the Christmas tree lighting in a minute. Look at all those poles. They look like truffler trees right here from the movie The Lorax. They're just missing that fluffy thing here on top. There's the Grinch. Look at the Woo Hill. A nice Christmas tree. This place is packed. Look, everybody's waiting for the Christmas tree to be lightened up. You know how they say all this stuff is for kids? No, it's not. I feel like a kid again. You have to smile when you're here, when you see all those people having a good time. We are having a good time. Palm trees in Wu Hill. It really looks a little bit like a cartoon here. I really like all the different colors of the houses and the lighting. It's really nice. Made all out of gingerbread. 
lot. He just passed us without saying hi to the GIV. We are not in Whoil anymore. We in Wu Hill today. Wu Hill? I don't know. Normally, you always meet here at the Who Will. You're right. Y'all guy, y'all know Adam the Woo or Who, like I always say it. And there's Daphne. She got a really nice channel as well. You guys want to check it out? And we are here for the Christmas lighting. Look how beautiful this looks. You ever seen the Grinch before? I've never seen the Grinch. I've never been here for Christmas. I normally see you at the horror Hollywood Horror Night. It's the last time I actually seen you. So this is amazing, man. I love it. Yeah, it's pretty good. They're going to do a whole Christmas tree lighting. The Grinch is going to come here and try to foil things. Okay. No more spoilers. You just kind of wait and see what happens. <laughs> I'm just already in a good mood right now. And they're playing really good music in the background. What, what group is this? What group is this? Trivia class. I actually went to his gravesite the other day when I was in London. Did you? Yeah, I went to see his grave. George Michael's? George Michael's grave in London. Ah. So this video is still coming up. I did so many videos, I didn't even have time to upload them yet. So the Grinch walked by twice already, I didn't get it. What was I saying? Normally I meet Adam here doing horror night and today we're here and we'll see what the night brings. It's a different hour. Christmas time. Nice, it's nice. In Germany it snowed about 10 inches today, so... I'm kind oh, of, you're better off here. I brought my big jacket, but it's not that cold here. I think, is it going to snow in Wizarding World later? It snows in here too. It snows in here too. All right, we'll check that out for sure. Practice tradition, who's over here? All the who's out there, who's from every which way and where? Welcome to the Hoobalation! I knew that they have the palace here. Yeah? It looks like the palace where they filmed Michael Jackson's thriller video. Looks a little different. They also got a Mel's diner. Well, I'm always going with my ice cold drink, but I don't have to say what he's going to get. He's getting a piping hot caffeinated beverage. We well, just also said got... you don't have to say it, and then you said it. Well, I said it, and. People actually, some people get mad that I say it, that uh, I copy you, but I ain't copying you, man. People get mad? Yeah, some people said it. Don't use people his line, ridiculous. you know? Anyway, <laughs> pause everybody. Merry Christmas. Thank you for inviting me here. <laughs> Appreciate it. Thank you. I've been here so many times at Universal Studios, but it's always good to come back. Simpsons the ride, Krusty Land. Whoa, fireworks at the studio tour. That's where we're heading right now. This 
is a steep elevator here. Look at this line here. That's going to take for hours. Not the GIV. I'm the VIP. Only today I got the fast pass. Look how fast this line goes here. VIP. VIP, partner. Well, we're going to be in the last car right here. Number eight. Good to see you, Adam and Daphne. And um, how many times did you do that tour here? This tour? Yeah. I've done this tour probably 200 times. 200 times? Yeah. I thought I've done it often, but I'm That's not even right. close to that. But it's all right. Right. I said I've done it so many times too, but not as often as you did. So I can give this tour. <laughs> I know. You, you probably know more than the driver, you know? They do have those 3D glasses here. <laughs> I see you in 3D right now. Woo. Those are all the different movies they shot here on the lot. All right, we are clear for takeoff. Let's wave bye. We Welcome are folks. clear we'll for bye. takeoff. Bye. You'll get the next one. Bye bye. bye, -bye. The naughty professor. It says the voice. The mummy. That's where we used to film. American Pie. That was right over here. All right, the live action rocket raccoon has wandered on the Brownstone Street right there. To the future. Uh, HRL, how are we doing on uh, time travel? We, have we cracked that code yet there in the laboratory? You got a flux capacitor going on? We're going to Hill Valley. <laughs> here, folks, is Courthouse Square, which plays the town of Hill Valley. In the back of the films. The back lot of the courthouse square that inspires the entire climate to back to the future. I had right. scenes up on the clock tower on that lead. There was a ledge about that wide. And I was standing inside looking at the ledge and I already had vertigo. I just thought there's no way in the world, no way I'm gonna stand on that. That was up there for quite a while. Of course I had a cable. <laughs> Behind and heading into the Big Apple. So turn on to our New York Street. Like in the movie. It's over to my co host Jimmy Fallon. Knows a little more about filming it. It was Jimmy right here. here. Take it away, Jimmy. This is where Jaws the Shark came out. So it's not exactly New York, but a lot of times when you see New York in the movies, it was shot right here on the Universal Metro sets. If you can make it here, you can make it anywhere. It looks so cool at night. I just want to walk around here. Large. But these buildings, they look like the real deal. Mmm, fireworks. But they're what we call facades, meaning we just built the front and sides of the buildings. You look through the windows, you can see they're pretty empty on the inside there. Now, what looks like brick and stone is actually just foam rubber and fiberglass built on a wood frame shell. We're going in. It's great to have you along. Oh man, they're burning! Oh, no! What the? Tram. Another tram that didn't end well for him. The, the other tram didn't make it. Oh, right. They made it. They, they, we scary. did. Yeah, they made it. 
American yeah. Graffiti, Magnum P.I. That's Biff's car right there where the manure got in. He hates manure. He hates manure. He hates manure. The paneling painted to look like metal. <laughs> I don't want to say it's a lot more lightweight, a lot more cost effective to be able to tow around a lot. That's the lost world. Uh, go on location with. Now coming up on the right hand side, we got our beautiful Jeep Wrangler Sahara used in the original Jurassic Park. Celebrating its 30th what? anniversary this Darren, year. Darren, I thought you got the original watch. Oh, no, mine's a replica. Man, I was driving in the parade with this thing right here. Dinosaurs in store for you. Now don't worry. Oh, goodness. I think we're going to be okay, but uh, if, if not, we've got the dino catcher right there up uh, front. So we'll have to use that to round these sides as we see. So keep an eye out for me, okay? I'm going to look up ahead. <laughs> Little creatures everywhere. Whoa, lightning. Are we at HHN right now? Let's go ahead and cue. Oh, no. Everything is flooded. He's a lot smaller than I would have thought. Real deep sea diving. We're going to hide down behind the pier. Uh, get a safe distance and a safe barricade. We got gasoline barrels. Oh, those aren't safe. and the Furious cars, Toretto's car. The Bates Motel and the Psycho House at the top of the hill there. There it is, the Psycho House. Yikes. Okay. Uh, now, folks, I want to put you right in the middle of a big action movie set. This is the crash site for Steven Spielberg's War of the Worlds. Folks, that is a real 747 jet there. We purchased a retired jet and then we tore it apart to decorate our set. Now we're going to show you another very elaborate set here. The actual sets used for the film Nope by Academy Award winner, writer-director Jordan Peele. Here to tell you more about the sets is Jordan Peele. Behind this Hollywood fantasy, a gold rush frontier town lies a sinister secret. It's smack dab in the center. I'll tell you who I am, boy. Is that the guy from Fortnite? I'm the reason bad guys use a nightlight. It's just like him. I'm the reason the boogeyman begs his mama to look under his bed. Did you know there was a party going on without us? First of all, I don't work for you. Oh, really? Well, tell me, Roman, who do you work for? We don't work for nobody. Not my suggestion clear out of here, otherwise we can't guarantee your safety. Guarantee my safety? I'm the one holding the gun. Yeah, but mine's a whole lot bigger than yours. Hobbs, uh, escort this now. This is our turn. <laughs>
man. It's all about family. We are lucky. It's all about family. Here we got the Whoville police car. We walking through the wizard world of Harry Potter. It really feels like you're in England somewhere. This place is pretty busy, but not really busy. What would Adam say? It's not busy, it is. It's a real beehive of activity. That's right, it is. Look at this. This is still packed here. Wow. A beehive of activity. Go, go, check this out. They got some butter beer here. You ever tried that? There it starts, the show. See, when I went to Germany, to the Schloss Deutschwanstein, that was a real castle. This is all fake here. Some kind of sparkle or snow. Wow, I never even seen anything like that. How do they project that onto the castle? Looks really nice. like a fairy tale like a nice little castle where the princess lives in and you're gonna go and save her oh no I don't think I have to save her she already got her prince what is happening it's transforming right in front of our eyes beautiful I never experienced something like this. This is definitely an eye candy for your eyes. Woo! Wow! What did you think, man? That was awesome. Pretty cool, huh? I never seen anything like it. Pretty cool. Absolutely. Whoa, definitely not a lot of space to move around here. And when you are a wizard here at Universal Studios, Harry Potter Land, you gotta have one of those magic wands. Look at this. Iranunus Karibus Ikrobus. Looks like it's not working right. <laughs> I never sat next to Frosty the Snowman. How are you feeling? A little cold? You want my jacket? We got the fun land, minion land. We already have a fun. I really like this Christmas tree here with all the minions in there. Are you friends with the little creatures? <laughs> Nobody, no, they don't open. Nobody opens. Despicable Minion Mayhem. Well, I think I'm gonna be here more often now. Well, my friends, that was it. Live here from the Universal Studios. Those are my new friends here. Kurt came later on, you know his channel. And um, I just wanna say, if you happen to like this video, give it a thumbs up, <laughs> push notification bell, and subscribe to Adam the Woo. Just to her, to else. him. To me, the German of Venice. 80s life. 80s life. See you guys later. I had a blast. Tschüssig.